good enough. <laughs> want to talk a bit about the reverb in the Lincoln. Um, all of our amps, we use audio pots for the reverb controls. So uh, what this means is you have a very gradual taper coming on to about halfway on the pot. So if you just want a hint, a hint, that's kind of a hint of reverb. You can dial that in, dial that in really easily. As you get to about halfway, now you're... That's kind of a nice... amount of reverb. If you go to three quarters, three quarters on an audio pot is equal to one half on a linear, which is what most reverb knobs are. So really, if we had audio pots like you'd find on a Fender or many others, it's not bad or good, but just a, a way to do it, halfway point would be a fair amount of reverb. And then, you know, on up from there. With the audio pot, you can get the full range. It just comes on a lot lo kind of slower. Another thing to note about reverb, the higher you have the volume on the amp, the more drive energy there is to the tank. So as you crank it up, you might need to turn down your reverb because it's hitting the tank harder. That, that send signal to the tank comes after the volume control. So if you're playing super quiet, you might find, gosh, the reverb, I've got to crank it. It's a surprise. And as, again, if you go to play with a band, suddenly you're like, wow, I really got to turn it down. So sometimes uh, if you're playing distorted, a lot of times you wouldn't want much reverb. Uh, reverb gives us a great atmospheric, washy sound. But when you're really driving it, you want to be able to start and stop and have that really staccato punching, uh, punching vibe. So... Each channel has its own reverb. Let's say you wanted to play a real atmospheric distortion uh, sound, you could. You could crank up the reverb just on the overdrive, but uh, perhaps more likely you might have a nice atmospheric sound on the clean, and when you click over to overdrive, um, you might have no reverb at all or just a tiny hint because it can wash out some of that, some of the punch, some of the uh, you know, immediacy and the excitement of overdrive. Let's talk about the uh, channel selection. You've got two choices. The Lincoln comes with a foot switch, which uh, gives you the channel switch and also the high gain, low gain of the overdrive channel. That's on the foot switch. Let's say you didn't have the foot switch with you and it was uh, not plugged into the amp. Then the uh, panel controls work. And you're gonna notice over at the end by the reverb controls, there's this uh, toggle switch. And that's actually the channel switching switch when the foot pedal is not plugged in. Uh, it appears that it's just switching between two different reverbs, but it's really channel one and its reverb, channel two and its reverb.